Hey YouTube, I just wanted to update you guys on the Ellen, um, Ellen tube rejection thing. Um, yeah, so instead of waiting for the morning, I tried to um, to see if I could put a short video together, three minutes something, to see if I could get past the filter. I guess it is a filter because I was thinking that somebody was gonna come tomorrow and approve it, but it looks like we got we got something there because I was able to share the page, I was able to retweet it, and it was not marked um, rejected. You know, so this is the new video. It's not as good as the other one, but um. It's the best we can do right now with the things that happened. Sorry, my art. Load, load. Win $3 million home. I don't need a dream home. Publishers clearing house. <laughs> they, they're still around. <laughs> so, yeah. So yeah, before this goes to some something else, I would just like to say that I'm glad that this uploaded, but it is not the same as what I tried to upload before. You know, when you have uh, you're an artist and you're trying to get your expression out there, it's kind of difficult when it doesn't go through. It's just another setback in in sharing 
your sharing sharing yourself because these things are deeply personal and it's difficult so what why is why am I pushing so much for CRISPR Cas9 technology well the thing is it's just that I get really 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 concerned that this is going to be brushed off you know it's just going to be another thing that in five years time many diseases will get the benefit of this technology while it's fresh and new but sickle cell disease might get the brush off brush off and, and because our voice is just not loud enough you know and this this is just a learned from experience you know how easily we are rejected and how easily we feel in, invisible in this world because sickle cell is seen with a stigma that is it is a, 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 a disease of Africans or, or, of black folks or, of people of color but that's not the case but that's the stigma that that, that that goes around with it so the patience to wait on things is not something that that I have not anymore not not from learning from from, from what's going on and, and from 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 the rejections you know not after seeing what rejections you get dealing with this so I'm pushing it hard because we need voices more voices loud voices out there there's many people working but I want to put up a fund to try to fund it I do not know why that video that I uploaded to Ellen to got rejected but this other one went through I did not use the images I didn't show the artwork maybe that's that that, that helped and I didn't put the, no links to to my patreon and my in this website this page because this page may might not be not safe for work because I do have some videos where I'm cursing and and, and, and I'm upset because I'm I'm, I'm a pissed off black dude because you know I see people suffering out there and, and nothing is being done and you have to understand I, I'm very very in touch with this community because most of the people who are my friends on Facebook are people who suffer from this so we share when we're in the hospital we, we get on Facebook and we get on our communities and we share we, we share what's going on with us you know, I wish DL, DL man, I wish you would post something about sickle cell. You, you have so much followers. I wish you would post something about sickle cell disease. I wish you would post about this DNA technology. You know, I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been, you know, pretty much spamming this brother, trying to get the attention out there. But so, if, if you think I would be upset about Ellen rejection. I'm not upset about Ellen, no, because it wasn't really Ellen that was checking this thing out, you know. It 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 wasn't that. So when I go to this to this sickle cell unite, it, it's a a community of folks. See, I shared the YouTube video, and, and Velvet Brown Watts says, "I'm sorry, it was rejected by Ellen." You know, it wasn't rejected by Ellen Velvet. It was rejected by a software or something on the computer that just picks out certain things. I don't know who rejected that video, but at least it's on YouTube now. I call it the at at Ellen to rejected entry. So it's just what it is you know you tell the truth about what your experience because that's what my channel is about it's about life art and sickle cell you know it's about what I go through on a daily basis if I if I upload 
because that's what the channel is there for you know so this discussion group this group is everyone who is dealing with pain and they may be in the hospital they're 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 posting about what they feeling or they posting their their joys and they're posting selfies they they, they you know a person may be in the hospital and they're posting selfies and they're trying to encourage each other we're trying to encourage each other to give blood to donate blood or to just give give feedback you know it's a support group type of community you know and we have to understand that sickle cell anemia is prevalent in our communities and we want we want people to hear our voices so DL you know you share so much about successful black people you know you share so much about you know black stories in our lives I've been trying to reach out to you about this DNA editing and, 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 and things. I wish bloggers, the, the, all these folks who own a blog or, or, or a news journalist type of, uh, uh, of community, of color, black Twitter, everybody who does these things, I wish they would pay attention to what is going what is actually happening with sickle cell disease. And you know, people are upset that Zoe Zoe you know is playing Nina Simone. That's the trending topic. That's what they're upset about because her skin is a little bit too too light because she has Haitian, Dominican and, and a whole other mix of races that put that sister uh, 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 that blessed her sister's skin you know sh so she's lighter at least the story is getting told about the wonderful Nina Simone at least the story is being told should it should it have been a, a, a really black 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 dark skin sister yes yes sh sure sure but but give the give give the actress a break it, it's not it's not her fault this happened but that's what we talk about that's what we care about that's what we we fuss about sickle cell is not sexy sickle cell is not glorious sickle cell is painful you know if we get arrested the negativity of it gets posted you know Florida teen arrested posed as a doctor <laughs> okay we get our pictures we're famous yeah you know, this is not something we want to be known for. Get get arrested. I mean, this is this is the stories we share. This is the stories on, in, in our blog sphere, in, in our in our community. You know, this is this is this is ridiculous. Sometimes it is. You know, and we gotta we gotta show love you know to to each other we have to be able to 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 share stories we have to be brave enough to 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 be vulnerable and show our pain and suffering you know we do we have to be able to share these stories i'm grateful that because i do have a treatment for phoresis once a month at Yukon Medical Health Center in Farmington, Connecticut, that I can, you know, say I'm pain free most of the time. You know, a good 90% of the time I'm cool and I'm pain free. I get some aches now and then, but I don't have no major crisis. But I would like people to be aware to, to, to donate to the national group, to donate to sickle cell disease. You know, to donate to the Sickle Cell Disease Association of America to help them start a, a, a DNA editing fund because this is something that's important you know you go to their website and you just donate you know you donate 
and, and and there's a story on their website right here at Sickle Cell Foundation of Tennessee speaks with gene editing committee I do not know how successful they were but at least we are aware that this technology is out there and, and we are so excited for it you know this is a great 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 breakthrough that could change a lot of lives there may be only a hundred thousand plus sickle cell disease patients in, in the United States but around the world there's millions of them that suffer and, and, and sickle cell greatly impacts the quality of life greatly impacts the quality of life so we need more awareness about these technologies and science educators to, 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 to spread their awareness about these things so that we understand that we are not left behind you know when you when you look at this group Sickle Cell Foundation of Tennessee uh, uh, of TN you know this may be a new president so I'm gonna say you know shout outs to Trevor T Thompson the CEO you know of the sickle cell foundation of tennessee uh, and i thank them for 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 reaching out for for going to 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 speak to these these dc doctors in washington that makes the policies for for this dna editing the laws that are going to happen with this because it is a very controversial a very powerful technology so we have to be cautious about how it's used but we cannot continue to c allow people to suffer I want to be cured, you know, but but a uh, bone marrow transplant is not going to work for me. So my thinking is I've been upset and I've been mad and I've been showing you uh, on what people do on GoFundMe. So we know this, this group that went to speak in D.C. is from Tennessee and, they're, they're sickle, and their name is the Sickle Cell Foundation of TN right so when I when I searched yesterday when I was showing yesterday on GoFundMe every everything when you search the word sickle cell on GoFundMe you see people who who are suffering and they get no help you know now this is the place this is the one that was sickle cell this found foundation of Tennessee that's theirs that's the same group it may have a new president right now or, or a new CEO right now but that's the same group for three years they have a tax ID right here for three years they've been asking for help on GoFundMe and they only have you know this much this much this much you know and they were asking for 250k two hundred and fifty thousand dollars it, it's been it's been up there for 28 months and they only had five pledges I have only six bucks you know I only have about six bucks it's just to make a point people it's just to make a point you know it's just to make a point so just to make a point if you ever visit this website you'll see a dollar bill donated by Hertz Nazaire just to make a point because I, I know I don't want my, my checking to go to go to, to have to pay a $37 overdraft fee because I did have to pay it this month already but I only have six dollars left in my bank account and, and today is what today is March 3rd <laughs> so you can tell how my life is you know so that's why I'm asking for for, for help at, at patreon to, to, to get to get things done but this has to be done we can't allow you know people to ask for funds and they get you know point zero 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 
95%. <laughs> you know? Because the math never adds up to, 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 to making a difference. They are a set-aside charity. They have a, 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 a tax ID. But nobody cared. And they are the one to champion DNA t editing technology. They are the one who are awake enough to know the science to go to DC and fight for it. We have to, to support people like that. Support people who are aware of science, who are aware of how to make a difference in this community. We have to support them. Black people, I'm talking to you. I'm not talking to Ellen, Ellen, Ellen Tube. You know, I need that community, the community that we have, the powerful black folks, the people who, uh, who influence, to share our stories, to share our struggles, to share what we are suffering from. Care. I'm going to put that dollar on that GoFundMe as awareness. Just to say thank you for, for, for going in front of the committee and, 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 and talking about DNA editing. I have to add that dollar there. So I hope you will follow my resolve to get something done. I hope that you can be inspired to get something done. I hope one day my voice can reach Ellen and maybe she will invite me to her show and I can talk about how I want to fund a cure for sickle cell disease using CRISPR-Cas9 technology. I don't want sickle cell to be forgotten. We can help millions of people around the world, f from Africa, from Middle East, from India, from Asia. A lot of people have sickle cell disease that are not. It's not about the skin color. It's not about the skin tone. It's not about being black. It's about suffering. It's about pain, real lives that should matter to us all as human beings. I just want to wish you a good night and peace and a whole lot of hair grease, black people. whole lot of hair grease. Peace. <laughs>